everyone welcome to another class how are you today are you great are you good are you amazing are you fine i'm great today i'm so happy to see you again so today we're going to begin today's class by saying the date exactly so let's see what day is today ready look and repeat with me today is Thursday, May 28, 2020. Great job. So today is Monday? No. Wednesday? What day is today? Can you read here? Thur Thursday. Excellent. So today is Thursday. Don't forget Thursday. So today we're going to review something that we already learned, but I want to see how much you remember, okay? It's about the singular and the plural. Remember the plurals that ends with the letter S. For example, marker, markers. Excellent. Because singular is one and plural more than one. Plural can be two, can be three, four, five, six, seven, a hundred, a million. Okay, so that's a lot. So plural is more than one. So the singular, that is only one, doesn't end with the letter S. Okay, it just like book, marker, pencil, apple, monkey, tiger, um, cookie. Okay, because it's one. But the plurals end with the letter S. Okay, they're regular pearls that are the ones that we're learning right now. Okay, so they end with the letter S. Now, look here at my example that I, that I put here. Here we have singular, singular, and we have plural. Okay, so here we have an apple, only one because it's singular. Remember, singular is one. So, apple doesn't have the letter S, right? It just says apple because it's one. Now let's go to the plural. How many apples do you see? Let's see how I see it like this better. How many? One, two, three. Excellent. So we have there three apples. Because they're plural, they're going to end with the letter S. Excellent. So it's going to be apples. Remember? So repeat again, singular, apple, repeat, plural, apples, great job. So now that we um, review again the singular and plural, it's time to work. Ready? You're going to open your workbook by the one that is green, your green book, this one right here on page 68. You know what number is the 68? Is the one and the eight? The 68? Mm, no. What number makes, what numbers make the 68? The number six and the number eight. Excellent. So you're going to open your book in on page 68. Eight. Okay, so you're going to need colors, pencil, maybe an eraser, and your book. Okay, so this is your page 68, okay? So look here. We have here an example. We have ant, ants. So we have the singular, we have here the singular, ant. And the plural, because look, we have more than one. We have, how many ants do we have? Two. So we have ants. So you're going to trace with your pencil. Carefully. Okay. And then we are going to answer this. So you have to see 
to look if the ones that you have is singular or plural. Remember that if they are plural, they are going to end with the letter S. Okay, so here we have something that is called pen, but these are singular or plural. Plural, exactly, because we have one, two, and three. Okay, so we are going to write the plural of pen, that is pens with the letter P, the letter E, the letter N, and the letter S, pens, exactly. So write it with your, with your pencil, but please, I want a pretty handwriting, okay? You have to respect the spaces. You're going to be in the first um, floor right here, okay? Not up in this one. Now, let's move to the number two. We have here a bus. Good job. So this is singular or plural? It's singular, exactly. So we're going to write the singular of bus, that is bus. The letter B, U, and S, bus. Great. Now, here we have lug, okay? But we have plural or singular? Plural, good job, because we have one and two. So it's going to be lugs. L, O, G, S, lugs, okay? Remember to respect the, the spaces right, from right here, that we have here, okay? I want to see a really, really nice handwriting, okay? Now let's go to number four. We have here a cat. So we have singular or plural. Singular, exactly, because it's only one cat. So we're going to write here cat. The letter C, A, and the letter T. Great job. So we have here cat, because it's only one. Now, number five, what is this? That's a sun, exactly, sun. So we have here in singular or plural? Singular, exactly, because it's only one. So we're going to write sun, S-U-N. And the last one, number six, these are mops, okay? But how many mops do you see? Do you see only one or more than one? More than one. We have one, two, and three. So they are going to be in plural. Good job, because they are more than one. So we're going to write mops. That is going to be the letter M, O, P, and S. Mops. Great job. So now we see that we have singulars and plural. Okay, now you're going to circle the number of the ones that are singular, okay? I'm not going to help you in this part. Remember that singular is only one. So you're going to circle the number of the ones that are singular, okay? You're going to circle. Then you are going to color the buzz, the ants, the pants, logs, mops, the sun, and the cat. And that's it, you're finished. So remember, write singular or plural, circle the one that is singular, and color the pictures. Okay, you did a great job. So that was today's um, work. So you already know singulars and plurals. Remember, singulars are one, and they don't end with the S like this example, and plurals are more than one, okay? And they end, the regular plural, end with the letter S, okay? So that's it. I hope you learned. I hope you, now you are a master in plurals. So just remember to keep reviewing and keep studying and you're going to be just great, okay? This was today's lesson. See you tomorrow in the next video. Have a nice day.
Bye.